Hi, my name is Joris Jordan. And today I visited Washington DC by new offices on the Northwest. And I'm here to present some few facts to you when it comes to business management. So if you like to subscribe, please subscribe right now. And let's go to the next issues that we have to discuss for the day. Anyway, before I do that, just have a nice view. On the northwest side of Washington, D.C. Beautiful center. Nice environment. The weather is good, for, great for today. All right, so the number one issue that we want to talk about today is does a receptionist, administrative assistants, people that we highly give recognition to in these office spaces, in business management, do they really matter? This is what we're going to discuss today. Do personal assistants, secretaries, office assistants, how relevant are they in our office space? That is what we're going to talk about today. The number one reason why businesses flourish, businesses are seen as successful, is the way they carry themselves, the way they put their image out. And these are people that hire PAs, admin assistants, secretaries, receptionists. These are businesses and corporate entities that hire such people in their offices, right? But most of us take them for granted because we fail to understand that for a customer or for a business investor or a partner to take any business seriously, the first thing that they consider is structure. Even before profitability, even before um, any kind of uh, um, other things that they may look out for, right? The first thing that they look out for is structure. Structure, write it down. Never forget about this structure and when a business partner or an investor comes in a customer comes in and they find out that they can easily have access to you walk to you walk into your office without somebody receiving them without somebody talking to them without somebody giving them a receptive that is why we call the receptionist a receptive uh what do we call it um attendance to the place then it begins to click on their minds are these people serious are these people committed to their cause all right we are going to continue stay tuned so having considered the corporate image of a business or the structure of the business the, the second thing that is relevant here is the corporate brand talking about corporate brand when somebody walks into the office and finds out that the person that is receiving them is improperly dressed even does not understand good english or doesn't communicate well the policies even the ordinary policy the basic policies of a business it might not go well right so the corporate image basically is represented by the admin administrative assistant the receptionist the pas these are the people that speak the policies out even to these customers these are the people that communicate the ideologies of the business these are the people whose personality their personal um, appearance speaks volumes concerning the corporate image of a business right so we should take their 
appearance, their communication skills, their in terms of attitude towards customers, very, very crucial. And to me, it is very important than anything else. The third thing that we must consider when we are dealing with these people that we are considering as substandards when it comes to managing a business. I'm talking about the PAs, the secretaries, the, the administrative assistants and stuff like that. These are the people that carry information. You don't hire just anybody at all to handle these businesses that will carry information information about the bosses, information about the business, secret deals and arrangement, business deals, and all that goes into the business, it passes through the hands of these people. And inability to manage the attitudes and to manage the capabilities and to manage the interests of these ordinary folks in the offices, it will can or it will become a big blow to any business all right if you want to know more go and check out what happened to Clinton, what happened to other top business and, and and investment gurus who failed in one way or the other because maybe their secretaries maybe their pay is maybe their their uh, administrative assistant took out some information released some uh, secrets and did not go well right so please, the essence of having this discussion is that if you have any of such people, they are as crucial as your general manager, as your, as your CEO, and as anybody in the offices. This has been Jory Jordan TV. Enjoy it. This is coming right from Washington, D.C. See you around. Bye.